Hi, this is Mike Anderson and builder of the Freehand Steering System. Today what I'm going to do is show you how to bend on the sail. And what you see right here is the sail open and with the wooden storm sail. And at, at any rate, sometime maybe down the road you'll have to remove that. All you do is cut the lashings here and here and slide it out of its groove. But for the most part, you'll have the sail on in normal conditions. So what we do in order to bend the sail on is run the halyard line through the fair lead here, also called the eye strap. We'll run it up to the top and fold the sail over. This has three Velcro strips that you want to line up. Get the edge of the sail together. Like so. And then what we'll do is we'll come through the grommet, through the fair lead, over to the other side. Back through that grommet and through the frame opening and lay it back down. Notice that the halyard's on the inside. At this point, we'll go ahead and just tie a bowlin through both of the grommets of the end of the sail. Pull it snug, like so. That's basically it. You want to have about an inch of gap in between the frame and the sail and come on down here and come back up with the other side and go through this grommet this is basically now a downhaul Through the other one on the other side. Like so. Back through the fairly. At this point you can turn it over again. And Take the pennant line and tie a bowl in here too. Okay. Make the end of the line come through the bowl and line bite or the loop there and run the line back down through the fairway again. Let's snug it up. Come back up through here. And a couple half hitches. And and you can wind the line to stow it. There's enough line here so that if you want to reef the sail without taking it off, you can bunch it down and then secure it and run on the storm sail. 
That's one way to reef. Another way to, you can only do that when this has been weathered out and is uh, worn a bit so that it'll squish up. Right now it's too brand new and it's too stiff. The other way to do it is just take the sail off. And you're going to probably want to do that in 25 or 35 knots of wind, depending on how the boat's handling. And Larry has told me that he is one time was out in 65 to 70 knots of wind and cut and, and removed the plywood storm sail and ran on bare poles and the wind vane still working. Anyway, that's how you secure this off, how you bend the sail on. Very simple. And that's that.